the one in here. Was the computer saying it? Yeah. We're working? Okay. Let's just wait here for a minute. Okay. I don't know. Okay. Let's see. You talk to him and I'll tell him that we started a new stream. Well, we have started a new stream. Hi. I don't know who's out there, but we're trying to work on this. It's a little hard. Um, a little confusing. Okay. And I'm no help. So please bear with us. Okay. And actually all you had. Okay. Oh, hi, guys. There's 40 of you guys. Let's see. Okay. Sorry. We, you know, the last time we went live, we had people with us helping us. So, all right. Now I can see the chats. And I can't see without my glasses. Hi, everybody. So, we'll just wait for some people to get in here. Hi, Ox. Hi, Eddie. Rambling Rome. Mwah. Love you. Jeff. Wow. I got Sharon. <laughs> and now hopefully I can learn how to scroll this. I have it on slow mode this time. Last time we had a live, it went so fast. It was crazy. Dana, and thank you for telling me to restart that. I That was your blessing. Thank you. You did so well. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks to Dana. I know help. I, honestly, I, I don't know much about it. Hi, Patricia. Oh, we miss all of you guys. Let's see here. Just bear with us while we learn how to do this. Like I said last time we were on here. Okay, you guys are up here. We're on our laptops, so I'm used to looking into the phone. Oh, wow. Sandy, thank you. Thank you guys for all your prayers, all your condolences. We appreciate it very much. It was, I wouldn't say overwhelming, but Judith, it was just... <laughs> incredible judith my father passed away a couple days ago um well, i'll talk about that in just a minute thank you sally wow hi pamela hi sharon hi linda Lindsay, lisa sal and sharon hi sal hi sharon <laughs> sharon i sorry i missed your phone call i was trying to set this live up um, when you called in, so I will call you as soon as we're done on the live. Oh, Linda, wow. thank you. Linda J, thank you. Um, we've had just a ton of people writing us privately, um, the comments on the channel. I feel like I'm looking down here. I got to remember, look up there. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, the hard part is we don't get to see the audience behind us. That's kind of hard. I feel like hard. Scotty's like way uh, over there. Do you I'm want to okay scoot here. over a little yeah. bit? Um, we've had so many people reach out and give us hugs and condolences. and um, Thank you all so very much. Yeah, thank you guys. Uh, thank your mom was really surprised and your whole family and my whole yeah. my yeah, my whole family and everything's like wow. It's a little There's hard. Lots of, love, lots of love out there. Yeah, it's kind of raw right now, so it's a little hard for me to talk about it. Um, my dad passed away on the ninth at twelve forty in the afternoon, and he he went very peacefully. We were uh, both my sisters and my mother and I were in the room with them, and um, he went very peacefully, and he's up there. And yep. he's having a good time with his mom and his dad and his aunt and uncle and all of that. So, and he got yeah. to read so many of the uh, the yeah. prayers and the goodwill yeah. and the blessings. And I just I mean, really want to thank you guys. You um, sitting here with my, you know, with my family and trying to take care of dad with my siblings and my mom and everything and. I was reading all of your guys' beautiful prayers for us, and I really, really do appreciate it. I just I can't say enough about it. But anyways, we wanted to come on and talk to you guys about other things because, you know, we miss you guys. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. <laughs> I haven't um, filmed. Uh, I haven't, you know, I haven't done any of that, so we don't have any footage to show you guys. I am working on one thing. My mom has been pulling out um, – Things from 
like where my grandmother lived, my other grandmother lived. We're in my my other grandma's house. We're in my father's mother's house. And they uh, got the house when my grandmother passed away. So I'm in my grandmother, my grandma Pappas's house. Correct. And then my grandma Correct. Littell lived down the road from us. And my mom was going through pictures and we were able to find some pictures of my grandma's old house and some things were there. So we took the camera mm. down there today, actually, when we went to dump the poo. <laughs> we did. And one thing about Kitsap, uh, Bremerton area, they have the uh, water facility and you because, can do it for free. Yeah, because we are still staying in the camper. Obviously, we live in our campers. So, Sarah, you want to come say hi? Come here. <laughs> come on. You want to say hi? I don't have anything on. Okay, guys, okay. this is my little sister, Sarah. <laughs> yeah, look up there. Hi. That's my little sister. And my oldest sister just went. You want to sit down and play? Talk? No, no, I'm moving. Okay. They just went to the movies. So Sarah and Sarah's on, she's been busy all day with my mom. She is moving from downstairs because she has an apartment downstairs in this house. And she's moving upstairs. And my mom and her are going to be roommates. <laughs> so they've been moving all kinds of stuff up and moving the bedroom around and all of that. So they're all saying hi, Sarah. Hi. And she's sweet. Okay, so let's see. Hi, Lori's RV Life. Oh, RV Davy, hi. I hope that you're doing well. I know you're. I know you're having some health issues, so I. I hope that you're doing well. I don't know if we have. Hi, Craig. Thank you for moderating tonight. We miss oh, you. Love there you. you go. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't uh, tell anybody we were going live because we just kind of decided it tonight or this afternoon when we were coming back because we want to come back and say thank you so very much for all the the, the love if anything yeah. i have really kind of learned on our journey for the last three years is there's is so much good out there yeah i am just so overwhelmed with all the love that everybody has for us yeah. Is Jay watching? I'm not sure if Jay's watching. Guys, I'm going to make a phone yeah. call real quick. Yeah. Where you at, Jay? <laughs> Let's see. I would like to tell Jay thank you very much for the flowers. They were so beautiful, and we all appreciated them. Yeah. Jay sent. Jay is um, who traveled with us for the last month and a half, and I'm calling him right now. Ask him why he's not watching. Oh, who goes, <laughs> <laughs> Why are you not on the computer? Hi, Jay. <laughs> You 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 got you need to get on you need to get on YouTube. We're live. Well, shit. Hey now. <laughs> You're live, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> There's they're saying hello to you. Well, let me get to it. Okay. <laughs> where, are you, where are you at, home? No, yeah. we're at my mother's house. Let's see, Linda's saying hi. It's kind of going really fast, you guys. Uh, God of Thunder says hi, Jay. <laughs> Bunch of you guys are saying yeah. hi. Okay, Raised I'm going to hang up. I'm going to hang Thank up. Thank you guys for all the. They're all saying hi, to you, but I got to go because I think it's uh, <laughs> interfering. It's interfering with the live. <laughs> get, so get on there and I'll call you back when I'm done. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> well, so Jay, kind of one of the reasons we wanted to do this. lipstick on my lips, you guys. <laughs> you guys want to see a really neat trick for all you women out there when you have lipstick that's getting on your teeth? Just go like this. Go. And then pull it off on your finger. <laughs> that? What? And I, did, I didn't do that before I got on here. I put lipstick on real quick, and I was messing with the live, so I forgot to do that. Anyways. Oh. Oh, uh, Twin Sparrows. We miss all our friends out there. And we miss uh, the 70 degree weather. It has been 36 and 39 yeah. degrees around here. I'm getting cold. Yeah. <laughs> oh, get over but, it. Uh, so, hi, Catherine. Thank you, hon. I appreciate that. I do. It's, it's kind of hard for me to read all of these, you guys. I, I will go back and look at every single one of them when we get off of here. 
Oh, I'm glad your mom and your sister will have a full, very, uh, with her full time. Very sweet. Oh yeah. Yeah. My sister's Sarah. How long have you lived with mom? And dad. Yeah. And dad. Uh, five years. Five years. So yeah. Plus another 25 on top of that. I've lived, I've lived in my own space. Yeah. I, I told him you had your own apartment. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Kathy. So oh, Carolyn, hi Carolyn. You guys, thank you for moderating. I appreciate it. Sorry, I didn't give you guys a heads up. Let's yeah, see who's all kind of here. Oh my gosh. Hi, Jay. Jay's thing. on here finally. So what I was saying, um, Jay was uh traveling with us for the last month and a half, and um we had to cut that short, but hopefully Jay will come back out with us and travel a little bit more with us as soon as we get back on the road. And you missed it. My little sister just came over. Do you want to tell Jay again? Yeah. Okay, hang on, guys. I'm going to turn you guys around. Hi, Jay. I want to say thank you so much for the flowers. And my mom can't wait to plant them in our front yard. And it was very beautiful gesture. Thank you so yeah. much. Yeah, they're beautiful. You want to, can you carry that over here? Yeah. Uh -oh. Okay, let, let's see. I want to show you guys <laughs> the flowers that Jay sent for this family. They are absolutely gorgeous. And look at this. You they're can't, I don't even think you can get it all in there. It's so big. But they're all it's planted. just baby roses. <laughs> it means yeah. summer's on its way, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's just so beautiful. Sorry, guys. I'll try to go slow here. But thank you, Jay. Yeah. You warmed my mother's heart, and I appreciate yeah. that so much. Oh, Everybody let's see. Oh, what did we get? Like so... 5,000 prayers? And... Oh, my gosh. A lot. A lot. And I'm sorry I couldn't get back to everybody and at least give you hearts and, um, and love. I just want you to know that thank you, I, we, I read every one of them. Just yeah. could not respond. We back do. To we them. read all the comments, you guys. Right. We just, it's kind of hard right now to get back with everything. Um, yeah, because the comments won't go Joni, through. Joni, they were lovely. They were absolutely lovely. And she's gotten other flowers that are just, they're so thoughtful. They're so thoughtful. And they just, they put a smile on my mom's face. So I, it's very nice. And actually, my mom is out at the movies tonight. My oldest sister came over and uh, my niece, and they asked her if she wanted to go to the movies, and she said yes. So, yeah, get her out of the house a little bit. She's just trying to stay So we busy. can take over. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just so she can. Free electricity. Yeah. I'm plugged in. She's just been going and going and going. So it's nice to see her. She'll be able to get out and relax just for a minute. Anyways. Hi, Cody. Oh, I'm trying to get. Hi, Jeff. There's I Kathy. miss you guys so Hi, much Kathy. out there. Oh, and I want to say a big shout out to Kathy. Yeah. Thank you so very much. And also to uh, Blind Lonnie. Views. Yeah. Blind View. Yeah. And also to David. Yeah. And Carolyn. And Dave. And Carolyn. Yeah. And, and, and Aja for and her video putting <laughs> something out there how, how yeah. they actually miss us. My friends miss and, us. And, <laughs> you know, Aja, I talked to Aja last night. Oh, Night of night of light. Hi, thank you. That was very sweet. I talked to Amber, or not Amber. I talked to Aja last night and Sue and Ed. Um, I just really missed them a lot. And you know, Aja always has the right things to say. She she can calm me down like nobody else, man. She is she's just such a wonderful. She person. is a good friend. She's just a good good people. Yes, yeah. so, and we miss you, sweetheart. Yeah. Hi, Alexis. Oh, Navy Ground Traveler. Navy Ground Traveler. What is that? I wonder, does that mean something? Are you military? What would that mean? Do you know? Navy Ground Traveler? I have no oh. idea. Right. Navy was usually water. Oh, so. oh, Russ. Hi, Russ. <laughs> we miss you, too. I hear that you're... Uh, you're with the group. Actually, I've seen you we on saw the, you with the yeah, group. Yeah. I'm sorry absolutely. that we had to leave early and didn't get to see you. And if uh, you're still at Slabs, Russ, go down to where we went before and uh, see if the <laughs> old, uh, what is it, the, the 
naked guy. <laughs> <laughs> the, the naked guy. The naked and, gay, um, guy and uh, what the salt and sea. Yeah. Scotty wanted to go back and film him. He thought know, that I was thought... really interesting last year. Well, he was interesting. I don't know if you guys saw it. If you haven't been with us for a while, we went to the Salton Sea and there was a naked guy there and he came down every day to the Salton Sea. Right. And he, he was respectful get... around us having he was clothes on for most of the part. You but... want to tell him your story about no. the naked man? No. Go watch the video. No. <laughs> yeah, the, no. I don't think that was but... on the video. <laughs> That's good part. He, He's a gentleman with the best suntan I ever seen. I'll say that much. <laughs> he had a little cloth around his waist and he was talking to Scotty and everything. And then, I don't know, all of a sudden Scotty realized that cloth was in his hand and he was cleaning his sunglasses. Yeah. <laughs> and Scott was kind of like, okay, we've had enough of that. Oh, you guys, I, I'm sorry. I'm kind of missing things over here. Is it going fast? Kathy said she's working on getting you some Jimmy Johnson, uh, memorabilia <laughs> uh, this weekend is uh daytona 500 <laughs> so as long as i'm here i should be able to pick it up on the tv antenna or grandma does or your mom has the big tv yeah. with satellite so Deb's, i will Deb, watch the 500 <laughs> Deb, Deb says she remembers the video <laughs> He just come tromping by the, the kitchen window and it was just, it was so funny. It didn't well, bother me. I've seen lots of naked butts before. It don't bother me for gosh sakes, but it was funny. I did want to go back to the sea because I find it very, it's absolutely beautiful to me just because a piece of uh, water can be completely glass. Um, the Salton Sea, I mean the uh, Slab City, mm, I don't mind missing that. But I did kind of miss the sea going down there this year. Oh, let's see. I'm these are going so fast. Pickled pecker. <laughs> yeah, I was a pickled pecker. <laughs> Craig said that. <laughs> yeah, it was. Uh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> hey, you didn't see it, did you? No, oh, you I wanted to know what Navy Ground Traveler. Did you write what that was? I probably missed it, but I want to know. Well, if you if you're military, thank you. I pre we appreciate that. Oh, uh, SJ Smith, thank you. Thank you guys for for all your guys' thought thoughtfulness. And you're my dad. hanging in there with us. And uh I think the prayers were the most uh incredible. Yeah, Colette, uh, it it is uh beautiful. You realize how many good people are out there in the world, which yeah. we know that. Um sometimes you kind of think though that there's not, you know, good people out there, but there's there's more good than bad. Most definitely. We were helped all the way back. We left. Papa it took Mimi, us two and a half you. days. And we were helped when we had an issue. Les Schwab took care of us. Yep. I mean, it, we got home perfect time. Yep. 15 minutes after the Super Bowl started. So I got to watch that yep. game. Yep. Nobody <laughs> falls off the universe. <laughs> Kim, I, I'm not sure if you had written that um, in a comment, but I read that um, in a comment. That's very true. So at least, you know, I think my dad's in heaven, but you know, that's, a, that's, yeah. I believe so. So what, God, we really haven't talked about it. what are our plans? Are we going to go dink around sure. here for a little while? And then we're not sure. Well, I don't know. We kind of <laughs> thought of a couple things, but we're just not really sure. Do you guys have any questions? I'll try to read them. I it's going so fast for me. You know, I'm dyslexic, so reading things I it takes me a little bit more than, you know, the average bird. Hey, there's Dan. Hey Dan. Hi Dan. Blue Van Dan. Hi Steve Steve me. <laughs> oh. And I think Dan's sitting right by the river still. Dan, are you yeah. by the river? Hi, yeah. Teresa. Oh, hi, Dave. Dave, I was going to call you last night, and I, I totally got sidetracked, but I'll call you or you call me. Yeah, usually that's a 6 o'clock in the morning thing. with Dave, you. thank you. Yep. <laughs> Dan's at the river. Yeah. <laughs> Dandy, I know Dan. where you're at, buddy. Dandy Dan, yeah, he's up there. I'm sure my dad's up there, and he's, you know, he's up there. 
having a good old time with his mom. They love to talk. We were actually laughing about it today. They're up there just, uh, I'm sure, carrying on a big old conversation. Oh, I see. Yes, Dan, Catherine. Said, yeah, I am. I'm dyslexic. Yeah. Dan moved to the hippie hole. Save that spot. <laughs> Did you tell them about that was the nicest spot ever. Was there? Did you tell them about the helicopter story? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, do you want to tell the story? Okay. So I wasn't here for this, but my dad, um, in the last video I showed you guys, he was sitting over here. That chair is like, right. Well, it's not there anymore. Mom had it taken out, but, um, he was sitting there. I hope I get this story right. He was sitting there and he heard some helicopters. Did he hear one or two helicopters? Um, just our helicopters fly by at random times. Can you guys hear Sarah in the background? She doesn't want to be on camera anymore. <laughs> she wasn't oh, prepared for that. I wonder if the stuff start moving. Okay, so there were helicopter. There was a helicopter, and my dad looked out and he said, "I wonder if." if they're picking people up like me and my mom and my sister said, what do you mean picking people up like me? And he said, sick people, people with cancer. I wonder if they, they're coming around picking people up. And they just kind of laughed about it. My, that's how my dad was. And anyways, probably about, it was what, probably three minutes before he passed, about three minutes before he passed a helicopter hovered over the side of the house over here and my sis I wasn't here when that story was going on so I didn't know anything about it but they were just like the helicopter's here <laughs> and of course my sister opened him, up yeah. the window to let dad's spirit go out and oh gosh it was crazy so I guess maybe the helicopters came and picked him up and took him where he needed to be so it was just cute Don't send one for me. <laughs> Hi, Freckles. <laughs> yeah, I don't want a helicopter either. They kind of scare me, actually. I, I don't, I always thought maybe I'd want to go up in a helicopter, but I don't, I don't know. want to go. Uh, yeah, Scotty's never wanted to go up in a, no. in a helicopter ever. I want to go in a P-51 Mustang. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I want to go for a ride in. Yeah, you and I think you and uh, Jay just talked about I that. Did. Or have Tom Cruise, oh uh, no, I wouldn't let him fly the dang Top Gun uh, thing, but you guys, that'd this, be fun. The super chats, they're popping up, but I'm sorry, I I don't know, maybe I can, I want to say, oh, okay, <coughs> workload withdrawal, thank you, that was very <laughs> nice, you love you too, hang in there, thank you. I don't know how, I want to be able to say thank you to you guys, and I, I don't know how that works well you run the I, computer much better than i would ever i'm learning even think we'll about. try to get better at this hey point. come hey, on there's camo dave hi dave thank you david dave thank you for for putting out the information for us um along with kathy and and blind views and carolyn and our other friends just to let our viewers here know what was going on. I know some people thought that it shouldn't even have been on YouTube, but the reality is, is that people follow us and they've been following us for three years and they're part of our, our peoples. I mean, this we're is our part life. of yeah, absolutely. YouTube family. So thank you, Dave. We very much appreciate uh, you doing that for us. And oh. as hard as it is uh -oh. losing somebody, um, all <laughs> I don't know what I just did. I did something. I may Joe have. Hyde. <laughs> uh, I may have. I might have timed somebody out or something. I don't know. I hit the thing and it. <laughs> uh oh. It's a good thing you have a touch screen on your computer. Let's see. Oh, Catherine's. <laughs> Click now, Nicole was hidden by Caravan Carolyn. I don't, I don't know what that means, guys. Jay, I just seen that. <laughs> Will you get my what to get? We discussed about talking Kim, thank, like that. Thank you, Kim. <laughs> thank you, Kathy. I can't believe that. Oh, do we have some nasty people in here? Yeah. You know what? That's all right, Bring it guys. On. Bring it on. Terry, now your dad is your new garden. Oh, guardian angel. Yeah. You know what? He was my 
Angel all my life. He uh, he was a good dad. He rocked, actually. You know what? Well, <laughs> dad rocked. And I want to say, um, your father and your mother, I could never ask for a better mother-in-law and father-in-law yeah. ever. I really got yeah. really, I have good parents. My dad was a great father to me. Very supporting. Um, you were spoiled. <laughs> I was kind of spoiled. <laughs> Not spoiled. I wasn't spoiled in the way of things, though. Right. I was spoiled in the way of love. Absolutely. And my mom's just an amazing mother. I mean, there is not anyone that doesn't like my mom or my dad. Yeah. Oh, Kathy, thank you. That's wow, very thank kind. You. Very much appreciated. Uh, let's see. Can't go. It's nice to go camping here. Oh, Pamela, I, where are you at? Are you in Washington? Yeah. If you're in Washington, the weather is just crappy for going camping. We, it's gray and gloomy every freaking day. Yeah. We talked about going up to the Dungeness. Right. See if we uh, can do that. But, but at least I when we know. do that, we knew it was going to be crappy anyways. Yeah. Up there. Yeah. I mean, we've right. camped all of our lives here in Washington. Oh, a class traveler, thank you. Um, love watching you guys. Watching from Ontario. Oh, from Canada. Oh, I love Canada. It's one of my favorite. Do we places. have to have a passport to go up there now? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. You know, I told Scotty one time that if we ever moved, you know, like to another country, we thought about moving to Mexico one time, but Canada, I just love Canada. You drive up through the border. And you go down their highways, and it's so clean. You go through their neighborhoods, it's clean. And I don't know if this is true, but we were told that you guys get tax in incentives. Remember to somebody told to keep your yards and stuff clean? I don't know if that's true. But when it comes to cleanliness up there, at least back when we went, you guys rock. Yeah, and you could go. You used to be able to go a little <coughs> faster back in the day because it was kilometers. <laughs> yeah, Joe Day, we I hope I pronounced that right. We will be back on the road. We we just need to do some things here. And um my sisters both took a week each off from work. So after they go back to work, I want to kind of be here for my mom during the day just until she kind of gets used to, you know, being by herself. She'll be okay. She's really a strong lady. Uh yeah. Yeah, David, it, Canada is very clean. At least that's what we experienced. We've been up there many a times mm -hmm. and every time been overly welcomed. Yeah. Um, we went up there, actually a story, right after 9-11. And we went into the hotel and went into the hotel bar. And the Canadians up there were, as soon as they, I guess they realized yeah. we were Americans. And this was just shortly after. They bought us drinks. They... We're so overwhelmed. They sang our that. national anthem they to did. us. They did. It was, yeah. <laughs> yeah, funny story. Uh, it, yeah. Was, it was really neat. I mean, their hearts were just like, yeah, so amazing when they were, you we're know, doing that. We're up in Surrey that. and um, yeah. all up, up there in Vancouver and, or, yeah. Yeah. And Victoria. Yeah. We've been all over the place. Love it. So maybe we should travel that way this summer. Ah. Sorry, I was reading comments. Ah. Let's see here. They go by so fast. I asked you guys if you had any questions, and I don't know. Let's see. Brenda, thank you. Uh, yeah, Twin Sparrows, I, I, would, I would live in Canada. Uh, yeah, I think they have good health care. <laughs> <laughs> At least that's what people say, but I, I don't know. I hear, I hear both on the... On that about healthcare, yeah, yeah, we love you guys too. When people talk about the Canadians, I always say, you know, those are our neighbors. <laughs> yeah, and they're wise yeah. enough to go down south and and uh, be down in Arizona with us. Yeah, you know, one time I was going to send uh, something into Canada. A gal wanted some driftwood, and I said, I don't think I can send that to you. And she said, oh, yeah, it won't matter. And so I called customs and I said, hey, you know, I want to send some driftwood uh, to a friend up there. And they said, oh, you'd have to have it put through a, 
I don't know, a heat process and all that stuff. And I was kind of a smart ass about it. And I said, yeah, because our driftwood doesn't drift to your side yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> to the beach. Yeah, yeah. It, <laughs> it just across there. It's funny to yeah. me. But I guess if you were further up, then yeah, it'd be a big difference. It's kind of like, you know, when you cross the borders into California, you know, like our fruit bugs don't go to their apples or their apple bugs don't come to, I don't know. It's just kind of weird. But I guess the further you get into different states and countries, then you do have to be careful of that. Yeah. You know, you guys, I know a lot of you guys have written, you know, about losing your your loved ones, your your mothers and fathers. And we actually had some of our viewers one lost a brother and uh, um, another one has it was uh, is her parents or, or her, I believe it's her mother. Oh, I hope I got that right. I'm not sure um, is, is like in her final days. So I, my heart goes out to you guys. Our prayers go to, it's yeah, certainly uh, not an easy thing to deal with. Um, but if you have a lot of people around you and, and, uh, Lots of prayers. It makes it a little easier. You guys definitely made it easier for us. Yeah, you did. Yeah. Ah, uh, Sarah. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. I would like to go up to Canada actually and explore a lot more. We've, um, sorry, I'm kind of moving you guys. We really haven't been that far into Canada. Where's the furthest we've been? We've been to. Uh, I think Vancouver. Vancouver. Well and I'm not sure where Whistler is, if that's We've in been, Vancouver. Yeah, is Whistler in Vancouver? I mean, in Canada. <laughs> we yeah, went up there yeah, skiing yeah, yeah. for a day. So, I, yeah, that, that's about as far we as really we've had, gone up there. Yeah, I mean, I would love to go camping and stuff. So, are any of you guys from Washington? Any of you guys on here? Are you guys close to us? We're, we're thinking about doing a meetup, um, not at our house, but maybe meeting at a restaurant or, I don't know, bowling alley, something like that. But we want to make sure that we have some people that want to meet us. We don't want to go sit by ourselves. Mm -hmm. We could go bowling. So oh, just oh, write in here oh. if you guys are, you know, in Washington, if you're um, – you know, if you want to do a meetup, if we can get enough people together, we will do that. And we'll try to find a local place. I mean, not local here, but somewhere in the area where maybe we're all close to each other. So nobody has to drive a big, long distance. Well, as Ocean you Shores, know? I guess that's a, yeah. that's a drive for everybody. Yeah, but they have that campground there yeah, at the casino. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I'd love to go to Alaska, Catherine, for sure. That's actually on my bucket list. Someday I'll show you guys my bucket list. I, I have a long bucket list. It's big. Are we and, chipping at any of it? Yeah. Are yeah. We? <laughs> we're, we're getting it there. Oh, Valerie, I'll keep you in my prayers. I yeah, guys, keep Valerie in your prayers. She's got cancer. Let's uh say some good thoughts for her. Yeah. Hey Dave, you got yeah, three days. Come on. Get up here. I miss you guys. For David? Yeah. I he miss can make Bella. it in three days. I miss yeah. Bella. Yeah. My sister's dog, um, Chiquita, you guys, if you watched the last video, she was sitting by me right here. She's right in front. She like that. is like glued to me. My sister's mm -hmm. like, like she doesn't won't yeah. leave me. She's such yeah. a sweet pit, man. I love her. And I was terrified of pit bulls. I told my sister when she got Chiquita. I said, don't even bring her around me. I'm terrified of those dogs because I'm kind of afraid of bigger. Well, I'm not oh, anymore, but I your, used to be afraid of big dogs. Now you hear your name. Hi, huh? Chiquita. You oh, guys want to see her? She's so beautiful. Let's see, see if that? you guys can see her. Hang on. Aww. My babies. And she is so sweet. Mm -hmm. Gentle. My oh, she's just precious. Um, and if you weren't so big, I would steal you and put you in my car. Yeah. Oh my Sorry. God. <laughs> yeah, guys. My uh, youngest son, Joey, got a new dog. Um, girl had passed away while we were here. Um, and he got a new dog, which is a red. Gold. A golden retriever, I thought. Golden retriever, but it's a. Um, a red one? Short hair, right? Yeah, short oh, hair. Yeah, short yeah, hair. Yeah. And she's, 
she's got more energy. Her name's Molly, but Molly came, Molly was over here mm -hmm. jumping all over Chiquita and Chiquita just lays there. Yeah. <laughs> she's just so sweet. Would never know she was a pit Linda, ball. thank you. That's very kind of you. <laughs> Don't hey, put the makeup. Hey, Dory. <laughs> Dory. Thank you. Where's Dory? Hi, Dory. They went by so fast. I know. It's really. Oh. Oh, Pamela, you've never seen the ocean? Oh. You should put that on your bucket list. Which ocean? I don't know. Any ocean. It doesn't matter. Oh, you want to see the yeah. Pacific. Oh, our stream ended? Oh, no. <laughs> I saw the little button down there. It said in stream. I thought it said. Oh. Gosh, we have a lot of people. 720. I'm really impressed on that. Yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> Jay. Love you guys so much. My heart goes out to you. My dad died almost six years ago. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's so hard. Oh. But with all the love and the prayers, it. I live it in Ocean Shores watching you. Okay, well, if we come down to Ocean Shores, we should uh, we should do a meetup. We might come on down there and stay at the um, casino down there. I, forget, I don't forget what Quinault? it's called. Quinault? Yeah. yeah. If we come down to the ocean, we'll we'll let everybody know, and you guys can come down and, and visit us. And it's probably kite flying weather. Yeah. I Is it kite when, flying weather? And I wonder <laughs> when they have the kite... Um, festival because i'd love to go to that you got mail jay says i've got mail what do you mean jay, <laughs> jay. <laughs> <laughs> oh you mean mail at the house <laughs> oh oh yeah that's right oh, we must have got there i was looking oh. on my phone <laughs> yeah montesano's right there oh sunshine i'm sorry you know scotty's mom you were how old when your mom passed away 24 24 and yeah. his dad passed away what, six years ago yeah. yeah 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 but again about terry's mom when my mom yeah. passed away terry's mom tina came up and said i will be your mom if you'd like yeah. and she has been scotty's been awesome. in this family a long time he's like a he's not a son-in-law he's a son to my my parents yeah 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 so i think ocean shores should be uh, the plan then thank you tony thank you donna the, the weather's gonna get nice and uh we can go out there and play. Carolyn, you're just uh, you're just getting rid of all kinds of people. <laughs> Get them, girl. <laughs> Carolyn, get them. <laughs> Carolyn's Carolyn's deleting people. <laughs> oh, our Carolyn? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know she's somebody's on there. being nasty. Oh, uh, let's see. I welcome when are the you NASA. Kelly. So, Crystal Cove State Park and Laguna Beach. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if we'll go back through California. Okay. This is 99 <laughs> is a beating. I'll say that much all the way from Bakersfield to Lori. Uh, th th Lori, over. thank you for coming in. Appreciate it. Love ya. Um, here's the thing about California. So we got a comment and somebody says, why does everybody try to avoid California? Well, California is where we had that wreck. And Scotty and I just swore we would never go back through California. Right. And so all the way home, we were just like praying and praying. Like just, I mean, I was looking like out through yeah. the window to make sure that nobody was getting too close well, to us. It just, yeah. I don't know. It's like PTSD or fast, something. Fast moving. It's I mean, they just are moving. Yeah. And, sure. And Sure was pretty though. Coming down, um, what's the mountain that we came down over? Shasta. Shasta. The, the, well, we were on I five by then, I think. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely thought, beautiful. You know, I love the coast. I like going down the coast of California. That's beautiful, and I wouldn't mind going. I think we cut in kind of when we were the first year with Aja and Carolyn. Um, Jimmy and um, Kelly. Yeah, we cut in at I forget where we cut in and start and went back into the big city and stuff. Um, 
I wouldn't mind going down and seeing more of the ocean down there. But it's a little busy for us. I don't know. It's I, We're not big city people. I, I'm just not. I, I stress out yeah. every time Yeah. when I get into places. And Grant, I, I don't know how these people do it with 25-foot uh, rigs and then hauling something behind. Jay's probably I, I laughing be, at you because he was you know, a truck driver. He drove through things like that. Yeah, um, I know. But it, I, I just get panic. Carolyn, what do you do over and, here? And doing? then of course at I paid four fifty nine for a gallon of diesel, and I kid you not, I got back on the road, and I was probably a mile away, and it was three fifty nine, a thank buck you. less. And I was like, I'm just going to make it as fast as I can out of here. Susan Peters said, Have you just considered getting a bigger RV? Sure. Uh, yeah, I mean, we talked about it. The The camper that we have now, uh, that camper. <laughs> I love it. We love the camper. It's small. Yeah, the but... problem is, is that when you walk into, um, when you, uh, where's it at? In the, from, you know where my, my stove top is? There's a, a cabinet that comes out on the other side. So for Scotty and I, when we're, trying to get by each other no this big rump don't you can't squeeze by this big a rump, rump in a belly <laughs> <laughs> wait but there's a wait a minute so we, in, instead of bigger rig maybe we just need to lose weight, lose weight. <laughs> no i i think even small people would have a really hard time with that um and i would like something that has a little bit bigger kitchen in it freedom had oh you got to plug us in Oh no. <laughs> Scotty's like, you better hurry. <laughs> it is plugged in. Oh, but that's where it's not plugged yeah. in. Sorry guys, hang on. We realize we don't have the oh. we don't have this plugged in. Where does this all plug in at though? Now you can over here, over there on the bottom. Oh, okay. There we go. Sorry guys. Let me use the restroom real quick. Oh, how's the weather, Linda, in Florida? Yeah, small town. I would like a fifth wheel. Um, our friends Pam and Paul, they just got that new fifth wheel. And that I wish I could have shown you guys that in the last video or second to last video. It was set out. It, you walked in and there, the kitchen was to the right, had like an L-shaped kitchen. And then the living room and then just the bedroom up top. And she had a little fireplace in there, a little propane fireplace it was such a nice layout and it was 27 foot it was uh really nice 82 oh i wish it was 82 here linda yeah trisha thank you appreciate that i wish it was 52 or 62 sonora thank you I can read all those happy faces. <laughs> That's easier. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they did. Uh, Leah, they did. It was a fifth wheel. Um, I forget the name of pa Pam and Paul's fifth wheel. Uh, uh, I think you did video it. I did. I. Uh, it was I a beautiful what it size. Was. Yeah. If you go to the second to the last video, it was in there in the name. I said the name so that you could. I figured somebody might want to look up the design inside, but it. I'll Laid out you, really nice. It was probably the nicest one. Yeah. We've looked at um, fifth wheels before. Hey, let me get my coffee over here. Hey, Craig. <laughs> I still have my coffee cup. The Saints. Craig, mm -hmm. our friend from Mississippi, he, he gave me a Mickey Mouse cup and gave Scotty a Saints cup. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sarah, my no. sister just heard that. Saints. Yeah. Craig That's was what messing I said, with them. Yeah, yeah. Craig was, was messing some. with them. Yeah. So it's 82. 31 where Jay's at. Oh, 31. No. Yeah. Dang. Well, I guess we should have stayed a little longer down there, but. East oh, well. Texas. What's, what's it like in Texas? I think we're probably going to be coming to Texas in the, oh, probably after summer. If 
We want to well, go it's to not too hot. Yeah, we want to go to Lollapalooza. So does Aja. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So we're kind of thinking. Rara, where are you at? Forty three. Lord, I guess I should. Everybody's uh, got cold weather. Well, I guess I shouldn't be complaining Florida. then. No, wow. South Bend. Oh, so is that South Bond or South Bend? Oh, no, that's your oh, 34. Sorry, that's your YouTube name. <laughs> oh, I thought I'd seen something about it's 62 in yeah. Vegas. What's it in Havasu? I don't even want to know. That's right. <laughs> I had to drag the brass monkey and off the lawn this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Jay. <laughs> 69. Oh, Georgia. I oh. like Georgia. Yeah. Yeah. I think um, we will, we'll probably eventually go back down the coast. Like, um, it's only 69 of the slabs. Burr. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. <laughs> Dave. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love Georgia. That Georgia. And I was just watching New Orleans. Um, oh, some documentary on that. And I just want to go back. I really like the South. I didn't like the humidity, though. That was hard on me. But. I still would go back. Oh, and I'll tell you what, you Southerners, you got some charm. Well, wait a minute. The snakes, I thought the snakes I, bother. Well, they do, but I'm getting used to them. Oh. I'm, I'm getting used to it. Wow. Yeah. wow. Hey. <laughs> I'm not getting, I'm used, getting to spiders, used to spiders, so snakes, I'll tell you, you what. Guys. You get used to snakes. I, I don't want the spiders over there. I just have to have a big bat. <laughs> 43 in Southern Gina's California. Pizza oil. No, Stormsbury and I have not. We have not. Snowing here. Oh, you know what, Molly? I If it's going to be crappy weather, I'd rather it just snow, you know, really, instead yeah, of rain. I absolutely. mean, it just rains here, like, nonstop. And if it's not rain, it's drizzly, gray, and... But it'll be beautiful in three months. I need a truck to months. tow my camper. <laughs> yep. Do you have a, let's see, who is that? Uh, in New Mexico. Southern. Oh, I need a truck to tow my camper. What kind of camper do you have, Pamela? But a, a, a camper Hi, goes Teresa on a truck, Harper, we're doing good. Thank you for asking. Hope you're doing well, too. Yeah, Arkansas. Yeah. You know what? My mom's got a good friend in Arkansas. Oh, actually, they moved to Arizona. I was just going to say. <laughs> they did. They, they did. have property there still. They did. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, Patricia. There are a lot of snakes. But I think I am kind of getting a little bit more used to it. I mean, I don't know. Arizona, I didn't have to worry about the snakes. I mean, you do, you do need to be cautious because in Arizona, on a you know, warm, warm day. They could come out. Um, but I think we were okay. I haven't seen and Asha one. did tell I, me, be careful because they can come out during, you know, hotter, hotter weather. But I haven't seen a snake, a tortuga, a dang spider, or uh, or a um, scorpion. I ain't seen anything there other than a roadrunner. <laughs> In that Arizona? I, I have not. I want to find a dang turtle. <laughs> A regular turtle. We saw the big tortoise when we were in. Um, yeah, but that was uh, at Walmart Park. And Asha's <laughs> hometown. I know the tortugas have to exist in Arizona somewhere. Oh, you guys, thank you for all the condolences. I appreciate it. My family appreciates it. Absolutely. Uh, I take the rain anytime over snow, that's for sure. Well, I don't have to drive it if I don't want to. That's probably why I say that. Because actually, when I when I was working, I didn't really want it to snow either. Because I'm I'm one of those people. I don't know how to drive in the snow, so you know, I don't, I'd rather just stay out. Scotty always drove me around. I didn't ever have to. If it snowed, he'd take the day off because we had our own company, so he could do that. Um, if I wanted to go somewhere, he just, you know, we had the four four wheel drive, so we didn't have to worry about that. Oh, uh, Sue and Ed are on here. We miss you guys too. You know, happy what? birthday, Ed! I heard it was yeah, your birthday. Yeah, happy birthday. Um, we're talking about. Um, I'm gonna get this wrong. I gotta remember you guys' 
you say their name. Bandit and the Nomad. Ban <laughs> Bandit the Nomad, nomad Pug. Pug. Yeah. Sorry, Sue. I always say it wrong. How many miles on the truck? I just hit 128,000 <laughs> miles. <laughs> yeah, and she's doing fabulous. How many miles Absolutely. on your truck? Is that what you're talking about? Yep, yep. Let's see. And I did have a question. I'll talk to you later. I seen you change the uh, belt on Aja's rig. Did it break no somewhere distinct. or did you just do it precautious? Is Ed with you? Mm. <laughs> oh, Jay says hi to Ed and Sue. Sue, thanks for talking to me last night with Aja. I appreciate it. I was having a moment. <laughs> Oh. I don't like snakes, but spiders, yeah. I agree. <laughs> I don't mind the snakes. I am not a spider fan. Don't make me hurt myself. Oh. Oh. I thought Scotty was going to hurt himself when he came up, uh, came up from that bathroom with all those spiders. <laughs> yeah, me too. And then I didn't realize I was going to get a lecture about how not to kill the dang spider. I <laughs> should lecture to, about killing the spiders. It scared me. But... I think if I, <laughs> oh, I just smoked the belt a little <laughs> and Ed changed it out. Okay. <laughs> Less than an hour. Right yeah, I see that. I, I, right I see you doing that. Thanks, Ed. Yeah. Smoke that belt. She's out there for just totally giving Lone a gas. Star Traveler says, hello, Carolyn. <laughs> I do remember staying in, I don't know what that says, Carolyn. Hang on. Oh, no, not Carolyn. Oh, they're talking to Carolyn. Sorry. <laughs> I thought that was uh, Carolyn talking. And JP's Hi, adventure. Thank you so much. I know you're staying more. Dave, not me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, where's Aja? Aja's back in Arizona. They are at Slab City. As far as we know. Yeah. Per oh, her video. You videos. know more than. Yeah, because you might know more than me. Per video, per her video, she's in Slab City. Okay. <laughs> but Dave just told us how warm it was in Slab City. So yeah, he said 62 in the way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Not missing it. Not it's legal to smoke missing belts. it. Because <laughs> it was <laughs> get a toy holder so you can get a toy. Yes, well, you know. <laughs> All in good time. We're enjoying the little rig. <laughs> 56. I guess I shouldn't whine to complain too much if it's that cold all down there. No, not really. No. <laughs> I should have quit doing wheel shots in that thing. <laughs> I don't want to think about the snow, no. Oh, uh, Lance, my father passed away uh, on the 9th, two, two, three days. Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. Sunday. Yeah, he passed away. In the afternoon, he passed away, away very peacefully with uh, all his girls and his wife, my mother, right next to him. Oh, Deborah's here. Somebody's saying hi to Deborah. Hi, Deborah. I didn't see you come in. I know I'm missing a lot of you guys. Um, sorry. But I think you're doing really a good job, hon. I can... I can read them and Dandy Dan. Respond that thanks much. for coming in. I appreciate it. Yeah, we water snakes. Yeah, David Th Thacker says, um, "Did we see snakes?" Yeah, yeah, all we, over the place. The biggest one that I saw was where were we? On the side of the river. I right? went. I went. Uh, yeah, no, that one that was around the tree. Yeah. It was by where we found the uh, safe in the water. Uh, somewhere up the road. Somewhere in that area. But <laughs> I was That's taking big. video for you guys. <laughs> I wanted to get a shot of a train coming through because we have a lot of people that watch that like trains. So I was trying to get this picture of this train. And I went around the tree and then I thought, oh, it would be better to get the shot from the other side. And I wasn't looking down. And I went around that tree. And luckily I did look down because, you know, I always have my camera right about here. And for some reason I went like that and looked down and this thing 
Scotty saw it after I came ran, running to the truck, but it was at least about, six feet long. Yeah, yeah, it was huge. And I'm sure some of you guys who live in the south or mm -hmm. in those areas, you guys are used to that. Mm -hmm. That's but the you, biggest snake I've ever seen. Yeah, you didn't even scream though. Well, I was running fast. Yeah, though. but you didn't scream. I wasn't <laughs> running, but I was moving fast. <laughs> Are you guys going back on the road soon? We're going to go back on the road as soon as possible. We have, um, since we're home, we've got a few things that we're going to go ahead and take care of. Um, and we want to go up to the Olympics. That's uh, it's my favorite place. It's my happy place. Yep. Um, I want to go up there and do that. And, up to the Dungeness. Yeah. Yep. And we have a few things that we need to just take care of at our house and stuff. And if we're going to be here, we might as well just do it now. Yeah, Molly, it is getting kind of late. Thank you for coming in. What time? It's five, it's six here. So nine at nine. Ooh, yeah. Oh, Don, thank you. That was very sweet of you. I'm sorry if I missed anybody that uh, did super chat. I do appreciate that. I don't, this new live, um, this new live thing is kind of a little different than when we were on it the first time. It's nine here. Oh, nine o'clock. Yeah. I'll call you, Jay, after we get off live. Yeah, because we know you'll be up till my old garden snake anyways. in my garden. <laughs> me and me have become friends over the years, but I did not like seeing her babies last summer. No, I you know that creeps me out. One time we went up to the Olympics and we went into um, a rest area. Uh, it was kind of like a roundabout area, and we drove up. It was uh, me, mom, dad, and Scotty. We drove up, and the asphalt was like you know, moving. And we were like, what in the world is that? They had the, the baby snakes had just hatched and it was literally, and I'm not exaggerating yeah. thousands, thousands of them, yeah. thousands. It just On looked, the black asphalt. Yeah. It just looked like it was just rolling. It was <laughs> needless to say, my mother's just as scared of snakes as I am. So she, we, we didn't get out of the car. We, we left. Yeah. 70. Oh, what I wouldn't do for 70 degree In weather. Central Brenda. Valley. Central, Central Valley. Valley. What up the road? Where? It says right there. It's supposed uh, to be 70 tomorrow. Central Valley. No, you're not. We have a Central Valley here. <laughs> Scott, you're silly. Central Valley. So where is Central Valley? Where? Where's that at? You're telling me it's not up the road? <laughs> no. I want 70. <laughs> Holy I actually moly. grew up um, in Central Valley, which is uh, about 20 minutes from here. Yep. Central Valley uh, Road. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kate, I know, right? <laughs> 84. Oh, my gosh. I'm just I'm so Brooksville, cold here. Florida. Oh. Yeah, I think next year we need to go to Florida. Um Arizona, it was getting better there, but it took a long time. It was cold this year. All the way to two weeks yeah, before. Yeah, poor Jay. Out. Jay didn't even get out of the car for like two weeks. He's like, <laughs> is it always like this here? The first year we went to Arizona, it was it was warm. It was we were running around in shorts and Yeah, in, the, in December, yeah. Yeah, this year and last year was cold. But it it was it was warming up when we got when we had climate to change yeah oh from texas oh okay central valley's in forks uh, washington california okay storms are brewing uh ever drive through forks washington oh yeah <laughs> oh yeah and that's the right word Scott, drive through yeah although you guys you have live some there? Of the, and they have some of the best fishing up there in the river up yeah there. storms brewing do you live in forks Maybe we'll take a drive up there and go to Ruby Beach. That's that's just gorgeous up there. Anywhere around the Olympics, I'll go. I I that's just my favorite place in the whole world. It's because it rains and rains oh. and rains and rains. Almost oh, oi is it oi miss twelve? I'm glad we could help you. I do. I'm glad. And I hope that you, uh, I hope you're recovering or recovered. And thank you. 
Yeah. Let me see something. Somebody's texting me uh -oh. real quick. Let's see. It's not me because I don't have a phone. <laughs> <laughs> Deborah says, dang it, my signal where I'm camping sucks. Uh, couldn't hang on the live chat. <laughs> I've been camping in deep remote areas. <laughs> if you guys haven't checked out Deborah Dickinson's channel, go check her out. She's just such a sweetheart. We camped a couple nights with her uh, in Havasu. Yeah. 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 She's just really sweet. Uh, <clears throat> Hey, Saucy. Oh, where? Hi, Saucy. Uh, uh. You know, uh, uh. you know the one thing about um, the Cameo Awards? I have to tell you, um, I didn't know a lot of people that were on that, on the awards. And if you don't know what the Cameo Awards are, that's, um, uh, yeah. what is it? The Aaron's uh, Life with Aaron. Yeah. Um, and then Dave, like, co-hosts and stuff. But, um. It's kind of neat because, like, I I now know who Saucy is, um, and I like going over there and watching. I don't comment on a lot of videos, you guys. Um, oh, Saucy the towboat chef. Oh. Um, yeah, go check her out. It's she's she's a crack up. Love to watch her, but I don't. If you don't, if I come on your channel, I don't always comment. Um, I get a little bashful that way, believe it or not. <laughs> Yeah, you do. Yeah. I think it's my dyslexia. I'm always so concerned that I'm going to spell something wrong or, you know, so I just sometimes I get a little bit funny about that. But I'm there supporting you. Yo, yo, Max. Hey, that's a channel to check out, you guys. If you guys like to watch cooking, oh, my gosh, she is amazing. What about you? You do good cooking. Yeah, but Yo-Yo Max, I love. I, <laughs> I'm in like awe every time I watch your channel. Channel, it's like I I don't know how you come up with all those things. You're so creative. I love the little envelopes, heart envelopes. Uh, <laughs> don't be bashful. Yeah, I do get I do get bashful. Yes, I, believe it or not, she has been that way forever. You, you would never know it, but I was an extremely shy child. I didn't do anything without my sister holding my hand. It was, uh, I wouldn't go into a store. I didn't, I didn't finish swimming lessons because my sister moved up. <laughs> so oh, I, yeah, up. my mom would, couldn't get me in there. Um, I ended up not finishing ski, ski class, ski, ski school because, um, Kim went to another class, so I sat down in the lot. I mean, I just was really shy as a kid. And then you met me, and that yeah. all went away. <laughs> I talk a lot more now. <laughs> but I was. I was really shy. My mom had a horrible time getting me to go to school because I was so shy when Kim moved up into a different grade and wasn't in my school anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, uh, Carolyn, you're special too. Thank you. That was nice. Ah, uh, Yo Yo Max, thank you. I've been doing a lot of cooking here, but you know, I don't know when when your heart's just not really into it. It's uh, your food kind of flops. <laughs> but food really relax. Cooking food relaxes me. It's it's like meditation for me. It relaxes me too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I smell it. I it, eat it. It puts them out. It puts them out. Oh, them out. Yeah. And poor Jay. I had to tell you guys. Jay will probably be upset with me telling him this. I love food, Jay says. Jay, he's a little picky, but he loves good food. Um, <laughs> I took him this salad, you guys. Now listen, he likes lettuce and tomato, right? I had a I had two avocados and they needed to be used up. So I scoop them, I cut them up, scooped them out, put them in the bowl of, of salad. And I don't know what happened. Somebody came up to the camper and I was talking to him and I forgot to mix the salad up. So I made Jay his plate because I was going to take it up to his van for him. And I guess I ended up putting all the avocado right on top of you know, you that, was his, that, yeah. that was his salad when I walked up to his van. He said, he looked at me, he said, what is that? 
And I said, just eat it. It's good for you. Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't realize it till I went back to the camper and all the avocado was gone. It was all on Jay's plate and he doesn't like avocado. <laughs> but you will eat but it and you will like you it. You will eat it. <laughs> <laughs> you might like avocado now, Jay. <laughs> yeah. Lucky Jay. <laughs> I, you know what, Jay took us to dinner as much as we cook for him. I'll tell you what, he, Jay is such a generous, generous yeah, thanks, brother. friend. Thank yeah. you. You were Stay warm. so sweet. Yes, you did eat it all. <laughs> 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 Even if you didn't like it. He never complained, not one time. <laughs> well, why would he? Yeah. Thanks, Jim. You rock too. Yeah, Pamela, I'm I'm horrible at it, uh, spelling. It's not, I love spell check. <laughs> yeah, but it seems like it goofs up half the time, too. Yeah. When I do something. Yeah. And I'll read a comment, and I'm like, what are they trying uh, to Teresa, say? Oh, Teresa, good night. Sleep well. I'm like, what yeah. are they trying to say there? And then you have to kind Deborah, of you don't out. like avocados? I love avocados. I, I love them. We had a viewer bring, um, they gave them to Dave, uh, really beautiful avocados. They weren't ripe yet, so we had to ripen them. But we had like 15 or 20 yeah, avocados yeah, yeah. during the van build. Oh, they were good. <laughs> Jeff is now an avocado lover. <laughs> oh, you can't go wrong there. <laughs> yeah. Well, guys, we should probably get off here. We've kept you guys long enough. Thank you guys for Thank you for everything. Yeah, thanks for tuning in and spending the evening with us. It kind of meant a lot to me tonight because I was uh you know I miss my friends. I miss traveling. I miss my dad and it's hard to watch my mom go through this. And so I just, you know, we talked about going live and I thought it sounded like a really good idea to get on here and Are you happy see you my friend. Yeah. 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 I'll be smiling for the next couple hours laughing yeah. about comments and stuff. And I'm going to go back and read them. And if we missed your comment, we're sorry. It's really mm. hard to read this fast. <laughs> I even got my high powered glasses on. Thank you, on. Sharon and Sal. I'll try, Sh Sharon, I'll try to call you. I'm going to call Jay first and then I'll call you. <laughs> oh, all right, guys. Thank you for the super chats. We appreciate that. Thank you guys for all your love and support. Blind Views, Kathy, Dave, Carolyn, and all of our friends out there. Um, over there in Slab City, we miss you guys and thank you guys for taking care of us getting the word out for, yeah. to everyone. We love you guys. Mwah. See Peace you guys. Peace out. Be good to each other. Yeah, and love one another. <laughs>